Hello, and welcome back to Pottery's Kickin' It Old School, and this is, well, the next part of Faxanadu, which we played last week, and I'm gonna try to work off a memory here to see what happened. Okay, we went up to that one tower that was useless, I remember that. Let's see what we got, inventory-wise. Couple of queen keys, wing boots, and two red potions. Also, we can look at our stats, I'm rank adept. Still got our elixir, still got that awesome magic shield and the death spell. Well, let's go get some gear <clears throat> and see what we can find. See what kind of trouble we can find, rather. See, I really don't need these either. I'll buy it just to have it, Thunder, but I don't really need it. Because if I remember right, that's a pretty slow spell too. We'll get a couple of more red potions just so I'm not stuck with uh, using my elixir. By the way, this was the town where the Matic is picked up. If you wanted to backtrack to the beginning of the game, where that shop was where I got the magic shield and the death, uh, death spell. And for those of you who don't remember, I did do um, a game genie code for gold. But one of the unintended consequences or benefits was now I have unlimited magic also. For whatever reason. And apparently my gold never ticks down for whatever reason. It wasn't supposed to do that. Anyway, let me check and make sure there's no king keys yet. I always thought that guy looked sort of like a half-drunk Michael Douglas. He never lights a cigarette, either. Okay, so it's just queens and jacks. I think everything we're going to need in this area is queen key. Oh, I already talked to all these people in the last episode. Okay. So, let's see how much trouble we can get ourselves into. are only going to get more difficult from here. And if I'm not mistaken, there is... We're near that shop in the sky or whatever. So I'm going to keep an eye on the, the ceiling. Wow. Maybe it's that one right there. Can I get there if I backtrack this properly? Let's find out. I think that's the spot. So I need to time how I fall from the floor above. Yeah, okay. And hope that these guys don't sort of ruin my day. So I should be able to just go like this. Yeah. And then I'll just be extra careful with that thing so it doesn't knock us over and jip us. This way I don't waste our, um... Eh, well, I could just do that. <laughs> I really don't want to waste my wing boots. <clears throat> Stand by. We'll get this right eventually. So, I think I know what series I want to cover for the next, like, uh, Penny Arcade that I usually do, you know, for a week, kind of a Monday through Friday thing, I think I finally figured out which one I want to do. And it's actually, god darn it, it's based on something that my lawyer doesn't like. Because she's incredibly religious. At least she's become that way. And I'm not going to mock her or tease her, but... I really do think that the way she reacted to a story about the release of that game is a little ridiculous. So I'm going to do it. I'm going to cover I'm going to have a series on that game just to prove her wrong. <laughs> Cuz I need to. 
Like, the reason that she became a good friend of mine is because we don't have... We have very differing opinions. So if I don't challenge her intellect, then... She... Like, I bore her. She doesn't need a yes man, essentially. I think that's the shop in question. The one that's, you know, watch the skies or whatever. Not the song by Genesis. Yeah, it is. Okay, so this is the shop. Man, you better have something good for all the falling over I did to get here. It's probably gonna be crap. Well, ha -ha, you sell elixirs here too. Okay, well let me go ahead and take one red potion, which is extortion. Do I want an hourglass? Let's just take one. Why not? Unfortunately, I don't need anything else. It's ticking down the gold that I have unlimited of. Fine. You know, I was thinking, that guy is really durable, considering that the very first boss we ran into only takes three hits of death to kill. That dude took two. Which means he's two-thirds as strong as the boss. That's kind of incredible, actually. And then there's this little thing where if I... Oh, he doesn't do it. There he goes. If you jump, like, sits there and twitches back and forth. So you're going to die that way. There is a, there's a ladder up there, but I can't remember what this is. Oh. Hello. The dwarfs are chanting their mantras to a segment of the meteorite. They believe it has special cosmic power. Well, it does. It poisoned the world, didn't it? You get to the Tower of Suffer soon. Great. That sounds like a place I want to be. Not really. I always thought that one guy right there, that's nothing but a cheap hit point sink. Because you can't avoid that hit. It's an elixir killer. Remember, jump at the last second. <laughs> the gravity in this game is insane. Can I go that way? Yes, but I can't do anything with that way. So I have to go the long way. If I remember right, there's like a spell... I think the fire... Ooh. That's right. A couple of these are traps. He's gonna jump down. Yeah. One of these is the fire spell. Ooh, what do you got for me? Title. Warrior. Yeah, got anything else I can use? Nope. He's just for saving. Huh. Alright, so I guess we can't do anything with those. There's another set of buildings like this where there's a... There's like a wizard or something. And he teaches you... I want to say it's the fire spell. Great. Damn you, gravity. Alright. Let's try this again, shall we? Let him just walk over the edge. <laughs> God, I hate the gravity in this game. Really hate it. see what's up here. This might be the fire spell guy. Maybe? Nope. Alright, maybe this is the Tower of Suffer. Yeah, I don't need to see that message again. I'm gonna kill this guy. There. 
Okay. <coughs> you can tell this is kind of still early because the basic enemies are still being presented to me. They do get harder. Sink again. Built in lag. I think I went the wrong way. Wow, you took three. Look at that built in lag. Well, I guess I can go this way. Second jump! Great. I'm really hurt. I am not wasting my elixir, that's some BS. Okay, let's see where we're at. Aha! This was the Tower of Suffer. Onyx Pendant. I think that's the Onyx Pendant. I know there's two of them. Ah! Alright, let's go see what's in the other tower. Or other side of this tower, rather. Kinda curious. What the heck? I can't jump that high. Oh, I can jump that high. Haha! <laughs> okay, I need that thing to drop. Or I have to take the hit. Maybe I have to take the hit. Ah! Oh. Can I get back up there? Okay. Not the end of the world. Well, that was useless. Alright, so we have to find another way around. Wow, if I didn't have unlimited magic, I'd be screwed right now. You know what? I don't need to go that far down. There we go. There has to be something that makes going the other way worthwhile. There has to be. Like, there's something there. Probably like a potion or something. Something I'm gonna regret going after. But at least I get free heals doing this little back and forth. Which means I don't have to waste another red potion, which is nice. I'm actually recording this on a Monday, because I don't really have anything to do after work today, and I adopted out my puppy tonight to a very nice young lady who is not exactly a newlywed. She's engaged, and she seemed really, she seemed like the right person for this dog, so it worked out really good. And of course, you know, that one time that I decided that nobody wants to hang out tonight, everyone's starting to send me PMs on my Discord server. <laughs> Shocker. 
This guy's gonna hit me. Oh. C. Damn it! Oh, I gotta walk all the way around now. Hot oh, bastard. Man, this the juice better be worth the squeeze. That's all I've got to say. Like, there better be something epic. I will do this one more time, just to make sure. I just realized I didn't have to go this way either. It's fine. Whatever. What else was I going to do, right? Well, let me see if I can make it. Good, I don't have to use my red potion after all. I keep hitting the wrong button. Here, I'm gonna switch it to that so I don't accidentally use a red potion. All right, free heals. that guy, yep, let's kite him over there, and then we'll go here. I'm not even gonna mess with him. I don't even need the experience, so. Alright, let's try not to screw this up this time. Look, a free hourglass. You know, that thing I just wasted 2,800. Yeah. Not a big deal, I guess. Okay, over the top. Filtered Lurg. I actually do want the bread. I guess I was wrong about the max gold thing. I was pretty sure it was 65535, but I guess I'm wrong. Maybe the experience is. That's all I can think of. The guy that's in my lobby for working stiffs right now, he's actually, um... He's Night Strike from Hit or Miss, in case you were wondering. Uh, there's nothing up there. I guess we're done here. So basically that whole thing was for an, a drop that I technically don't need. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. durable than I remember. Oh, I need that. <laughs> I need that. Come here. Full health. Nice. Alright, so we made that jump. Let's go this way. That's where I need the boots. Okay. We're done with that area below us. So, let's see if I can kill that guy from here. Good. And then I need to use the boots. That's the only way over there for this. What the heck? Okay, that's twice that's happened now. Huh. Fourteen 
seconds. I'm just going to avoid all the fights. Why not? Yep. There's another town up here. See how fast he climbs the, the stairs, or the ladders, with the wing boots on? It's quick. The power of the wing boots is gone! Yep. It's dangerous to leave town unless you have a magic shield. I have one, actually. Thanks for telling me. I should have a new title. Hero. Sure. Anything else to say, or is it just mantra? Just mantra. You need peace of mind. Wow, we got pretty far. It's only been 20 minutes so far? All right. This guy doesn't have a nurse. She must have quit for sexual harassment or something. I mean, for 2,500 gold, Jesus. Yeah, that's extortion. So he's probably... He's charging 2,500 because he has an alimony payment. <laughs> that's why the nurse left him. There is a magic cane which will give you magic power. Wow, that's... Could you be any more vague? When you hold the dwarf's meteorite in your hands, <clears throat> it will become black onyx with power inside. Well, I'm pretty sure I got one of those. I need the other one. Are they going to start selling king keys yet? Yep. I'm not sure if I need it yet, though. We'll carry one. Check my inventory. Wow, I got two hourglasses. I really don't need any. I wonder if I could sell them. Yes. I almost never sell anything in this game. Oh, he doesn't buy them! Weak! Ooh, full plate armor. Yes, sir. Yeah, that half-plate armor, you don't wear it, or studded mail. That's one of the armors you wear the least. So, like, in this game, your longsword, your ride, or die for about two-thirds of the game. The full-plate mail is your ride or die armor for the next two-thirds of the game. Like, you take it a long way. Alright, so let's upgrade. Look at that, now our feet are covered. Nice. They're not puppies. There's three generations of dog on my bed right now. I'm lost. My magic does not work. Well, maybe if you put down that bottle. The door to the capital town below is open. Go to it now. Uh, okay. Ah, the squids. My people. These are my people. I don't even need this. But hey, the bread's good. Really? Cheap shot. I gotta tell you, that death spell does make life easy. I'm just looking up at the ceiling just in case, because I know there's another tower somewhere. But I don't have extra wing boots, do I? So, oh wait, I don't think I need them. That's, that's the tower over there. Yeah, okay. Yay, good, really old memories. Yep, this is the guy. So this is the other tower, and I think I need the queen key for this. Oh! Okay, so we are using kings already. Fine. This is another one of those major towers. I think this is where I get the other pendant. Let's 
faceless specter of a woman. She scares me. Man, there better be something in this tower. <sighs> Aside from bad gravity and low ceilings. Wait a minute! There's nothing here! I just wasted a king key. Damn it. That was a 1500 gold waste of money. Damn it. Fine. Well, let's go back to town and get another king key. Because I'm pretty sure I'm going to need it. How very kinky. Hoo hoo. How many more mistakes can I make this episode? I guess we're gonna find out. Man, that guy's durable. Well, hey, at least now we know, right? Look how durable those bees are. Did you see that? Wow. Those things can take a beating. Calm down. Alright. New king key, and then haul buns back. This town that we're going back to, you actually spend quite a bit of time there. Like, you, you come back here often. Usually just for replenishment or whatnot. But I got another title, too, if I really want it. I think I might carry two. Oh, my inventory is full. Okay. I'm just gonna use it and get rid of it. Hear the music slow down. What that would do is it would freeze all the enemies. I almost never use the damn thing. Certain bosses, it'll slow them down. Not just stop them. They'll like they'll be very choppy. Wow, my dogs are going crazy. I wish I knew why. I mean I got three of them in here. My dogs, the ones that are in my room, they're calm. I think the meat prices are insane here too, right? Two fifty is not bad. Oh, it doesn't fill you, man. All right, it's still cheaper than the doctor. That was only five hundred. Okay. Now, if I didn't have unlimited magic, I would not be doing the death spam, honestly. Would not recommend it at all, but I'm just doing this for expediency, honestly. Because, you know, we're doing this for story. Your grind will obviously be longer if you do it, you know, legit. I'm going to need that HP now. Don't you follow me? Overtime! Looks like I've got two choices again. So let's make another mistake and go this way. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 let's not do that. Because if I remember right, that's where the other towers are, uh, or buildings are with the fire spell over here on the right. Yup, that's what it was. 
Yep. Okay, so this guy's gonna teach us fire. It can be magic of justice or a magic of destruction. It all depends on who uses it. I'm a destructive bastard. The only thing is, is it's not as powerful as death, but it doesn't use up as much MP as death. But I have unlimited MP. But I'll show you how it works. Well, let me show you thunder. Because this one is slow. Slow. Not very powerful. This one here has a unique ability to... I think shove your enemy across the screen. Yeah. So in that regard, you know, it's kind of useless because it's a, it's a distance maker. But because I don't need distance, we'll stick with death because it's powerful. Okay, thank you. Alright, we're at that point now where I don't want to make jumping mistakes. There we go. Oh, he's, he's immune to death! Come here! If you go straight ahead, you will get to the Tower of Mist. If you defeat the dwarf who lives in the tower and get the meteorite, come back here. He's sending me on an errand. Watch that be poison. Just my luck, man. So this door, no bueno. Ace. That's a key... That's a one-use key, just like the Joker. You are not getting that shot off. Alright. And I do need the health, so I'm going to go ahead and do this. Hopefully I didn't screw up by losing that jump from up here. Good. Actually, you know what? I'm going to do the health again. One more time. I want full health. Kind of need it. The one thing that was great about the longsword is, is if you're really up close, when you do the swing, it actually hits him twice. So it does stack, which is really nice. I think only the dagger wouldn't do that. Damn it, really? That looks like a road to nowhere. That guy tends to float. So, we'll just kill him. What he'll do is he'll jump and he'll cling to the ceiling, more or less. And then his, his drop is unpredictable. Sometimes he drops instantly, sometimes he doesn't drop forever. Okay. Jump here and here. We're almost near that tower. Oh no, why couldn't you make me go the other way? What the hell? Screw it. <laughs> now you guys stay over there. Alright, this is that tower. And I know exactly what this dwarf looks like. It's going to be like this brain with a giant fist. Okay, let's go ahead and use up one of these keys. Every time I saw those guys, it was like a mix of Davy Jones from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and Vega from Street Fighter 2, which obviously came way later after this game, but... I just remember seeing them, I'm like, yeah, ooh, ointment, don't you disappear on me now. He 
Yup, let's take it and then rush over here. He's not the boss. The boss is up top. Oh god, not you. Oh, thank god I have ointment. <laughs> that would have pissed me off. That's the guy down there. I think. Oh, he had an elixir down there, too. Huh. This, o this ointment's about to wear out. Maybe the other way was the, the boss. Huh. Wrecked! Stupid bees. Alright, how many hits are you gonna take? Oh, you're not there yet. Slow bro. Five? Six? Seven? I know fire kept... It'll, it'll shove him all the way over. I don't even need it. Damn. So it was the other way. <sighs> really? Come on now. Oh, it happened again. Stupid bees. Stay low. These are all hit point sinks. right here, yeah? Nope. Right here? Yes. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. You stay away. Alright. <laughs> that was a bit too close for comfort. I think that to the left is where that other flying guy was, which means the boss should be over here. Eventually over here? Does this guy do the little twitch thing too? Yeah, I see that. Don't you run up on me like that? There he is. See, you can just sort of cheat this one. Like, you could play it out and hit him with the sword over and over. Or you can just do it like this. Like, why fight hard when you can fight smart? Make him jump. There we go. Come on. Do a little leap. Come on. Doesn't want to oblige. Fine. Whatever. He's just going to keep jumping, isn't he? Ow. Oh, shoot. No, 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 you don't. It is on expended. Yup. All right. Good. Now we can get out of here. We. I can't believe I didn't get ripped off on that one. I don't want to lose my elixir, and red potions are easy to get. Because I know this guy's right here. Hm. Oh, well. I have to get down eventually, because the door's at the bottom. Oh, no, you don't. Sweet. Oh, man. Alright, now we gotta go back to that one guy who sent us on this errand. Ah. 
I want the bread. No, no, you don't. Leave me alone, frog. I think it's a frog. Oh god. Okay, I gotta go over here. Alright, I need to make these jumps perfect. Because we do actually have to go... Oh, shit! Well, hey, look at that. We're back at the town. That's actually a good thing. Let's do that. Let us rearm and re-up. I think that's a smart plan. I'm starting to think I don't need the queen keys anymore, either. Because the next zone we're going in is... First of all, it's arguably my favorite one of the game. Music's really cool, too. And it feels the most open world. And I think it's only king keys. So, let's do... That. Let's sell my queen key. Let's go get a king key. That seemed like more than 600. <laughs> I guess my gold thing screws up the sales too. Whatever. Alright, how many do I have? Two. That's good enough. Let's go get one more red... Well, let's go get our title. And then we'll go get one red potion. Yeah, it should work. Soldier. Not, not Chevalier. Cavalier. That is one of the titles of this game. I would always get that one and just stop. I'm like, okay, that's a cool one. Sounds cool. I would like that. Now, if I really wanted to stack up nice, what I could do is this. Actually, you know, I'll hang on to it. I don't think I need it. So I'll put the key in my inventory like that. Oh, you know what? I can't. I have to leave one space open. Yeah. Because the guy's going to give us the ace key. Spoilers. I'll tell you what, having that money thing actually makes getting through this segment of the game that I'm not a fan of really tolerable. Like, this is the part I always dread every time I play this game. And it's just because of the visibility. It's not that it's hard or anything, it's just I hate the visibility of it. nothing. And this is the tower, or this is the way we need to go. Because the other thing was the, uh... Fire spell. Sorry. Brain farted. Alright. If you rush him... You can get that done. As long as there are crazed dwarfs. Not dwarves! Dwarfs! <laughs> the deadly threat of the meteorite will loom over the elves. I got the meteorite! I took it! Conflate. Yes. I need to go to Conflate. That's poison that can kiss my ass. Now, anytime I come back to that guy, if I wanted to come back to this zone, he'll give you the ace key again. But here comes my favorite part! Best music of the game. I guess one could argue that the last stage had really good music, too. It kind of does. But this is definitely my favorite zone. Because it's like the top of the tree, more or less. 
I do really like the music to this. That in this zone is a bit of a maze, if I'm not mistaken. Like, there's a hidden item drop in one of these corners, if you do it fast enough, and... This, this area is less linear than most on the map. Because it lets you take two or three different paths. And I th if I remember right, the tree... Actually, it has a brown section and a green section. Definitely my favorite zone. I know my I know I'm repeating myself, but it's my favorite zone. That is that poison? That looks like poison. Are you poison? Son of a bitch. This is a way to conflate, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. And the, the priest is so important here, he gets a guard. See? He's an important person. Do you have another title for me? Yeah! See that? Mermidian. Mer... Mer... Mermin? I thought it was Mermidian, but it's Mermidden. I don't know what that means. I've never looked it up. Maybe one of y'all can leave it in the comments. Alright, dude, what do you got for me? The town is surrounded by doors for protection. Okay. Did you get a Nurse Joy? Nope. <laughs> Divorce doctor. What do you got? This is a trading town called Conflate. Well, thanks. Now, do we get out of the longsword yet? I can't remember if it's here or not. Yes! Giant Blade! Uh, looks like I'm gonna need wing boots again soon. Giant Blade. It's basically a longsword with, you know... With a longsword version of Raphael's Psy. Sure. I wish you could buy this hourglass off me. That would be great. Will you buy it? Nope. Damn it. Alright, fine. I'm gonna just use it and get rid of it. No, no, not that. This. I don't really need it anyway. Although, I think, if I remember right... You can hourglass the last boss of the game and just wreck him. I think I remember that being a thing. Hey, whatever. There we go. The only reason I think we need those boots is there's a section where you can essentially fall off the map. And that's the only way back out. I used to go to the town of dwarves quite often. Dwarfs quite often. Grammar. When we had business with them. That's it? The town used to prosper from the trading with the dwarfs. Grammar. It's this way. Oh, there's a wall there. Okay. That's why he was saying there's doors on both sides or whatever. Alright, so then if I remember right, uh, first of all, I need to heal. I didn't realize my health was that bad. If I go to the left before I go up, if I remember right, there were three of those, those giant dwarf fist things, and you have to kill all three of them for three different items or something like that? Well, I guess we're about to find out. I just took that one right in the dome. Yay, health. I'm about to touch poison! Stupid HP 6.
Uh, let's see. Is the king hole? Alright, I think this takes me to the green zone. Yep. Hell no. And you do have to go to all the zones. So, like, at least it gives you... There we go. Yeah, I knew it. Hey, 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 hey. Let's not get fresh now. Yeah, look at that! That's right, we get the dragon parts, or the battle parts. One has the helmet, one has the sword, one has the armor, I think? And then you get the final armor set of the game. That's what it was. Awesome. You can't wear the helmet right now. They wouldn't let you wear all the parts, and, or they wouldn't let you wear any of the parts until you get all the parts. Almost full health. I'm gonna touch the poison first. Because I think the HP I get back is... Negligible. Oh wait, I don't have to do that. <laughs> I can just do this. Let's do it one more time. And since I already have the second king key, I can just go straight to here. And this should take us to our next battle. Ooh, ointment, hello. I'll take it. Alright, let's make the run. Alright, that's the part I was talking about with the drop-off. Let's take it. Don't touch the poison! I think all roads loop back around, so I'm not worried about that. Now I gotta remember if it's the top or the bottom. I think it's the top. No, well, screw it, let's find out. That's right, I got the ointment anyway. It's about to wear out. Oh, I thought I took a hit. <laughs> Let's say the guy's in the bottom down here. Uh, is that poison? Yeah, it is. Oh, there's that rod down there. I have to figure out how to get to that. Actually, I think I know how to get to that. Let me backtrack just a second. I Don't even ask me what that kind of creature is. I have no idea. We gotta go get that other thing first. I think, I think this is the way. If not, it's a boss fight. Shit. Yeah, it's a boss fight. That's fine too. What dragon item am I, am I getting? Plate armor. Battle armor. Battle plate. Battle suit. Fan. You know, I just realized I didn't equip the weapon. I didn't equip this. Like, this is my favorite sword in the game. And I didn't use it, because I'm an idiot. I 
I never said I was the God's greatest gift to gaming. I've got the magic rod! Giggity. Just gonna get my free heals here. That wasn't enough to fill me? Jesus. How about now? There we go. We are out of here. Yeah, that other door that I skipped on the left, that does backtrack. I remember that now. In case you have to go back to Conflate. Which I don't think I need to. I'm having a really hard time getting to this ladder. What the hell? How about from here? Okay. It's like, I know I don't have to do freaking... Ugh, really? How am I supposed to deal with this? Really? I forgot how to deal with this guy. I'm gonna fall every damn time. Shit! Oh boy. No, you are not getting my elixir. The hell. I just realized I could waste my wing boots. I might just do... You know what? I'm gonna do that. Screw it. Bastard. You're not gonna jip me. Just walk your dumbass off the edge. Super lame. Yep. Uh, okay. Happy result, I guess. Nothing happened. another town here. Huh. Oh, yes there is. Okay, good. Daydreak is a town at the border. That's where we are, apparently. Why would there be an option for a queen key here? You got anything I can use? Tilt! I think that's the most powerful magic in the game. That's the spell you use on the last guy, because sometimes you need the angle. Tilt drops down, makes like a semicircle, and then it shoots up at a 45 degree angle. Very strong. But it's equally powerful at the beginning of the arc or the very end, so you, you don't have to finesse it. You can just spam it. That's a long countdown for that. Thank you. I think I'll take... Two more red potions? $1,200. That's extortion. Didn't the first town have it for like 50 Full health. Let's talk to the locals. Have not seen you for a while. You'll find a magic cane when you get above the Tower of Pillar. I think I already have that. Castle of Dartmoor is a complex maze. Yes, it is. I remember that. That, that map is a pain in the ass.
no title. I don't think Hero's the last title. You are the famous warrior. You are as good looking as I've heard. Hey, you really want me saying that around your man over here? Did you find the magic cane? Uh, yes. Yes, I did. But you know what that magic cane's telling me? That we're out of time for the day. So this was Kicking It Old School, Faxanadu. And if you don't know what the next episode's gonna be, I can't help you. Anyway, if you're new to my channel, welcome. But if you're a regular here, welcome back. Either way, maybe check out my other playlists and see if my other interest might be of interest to you. I want to take the time to thank you all for watching. Maybe remind you to hit like and subscribe or check to make sure your subscription is still good. Uh, I don't really encourage people to do the whole bell notification things because my release schedule is sometimes in flux. So anyway, thanks for taking time to watch. Maybe share this with a friend who likes stuff like this or maybe stuff from my other playlists. Anyway, we'll see you next week. Later. Thank you.